cooker at a McDonald's outside Philadelphia, passing drive through orders to customers pre-screened by his campaign. I've always wanted to work at McDonald's, but I never did. I love McDonald's. I love jobs. I like to see good jobs. I love when he said, I've always wanted to work at McDonald's with a straight face and expects us to believe it. Oh, do you? Well, no one's stopping you, bro. I noticed you didn't pick up an application on your way out. Maybe you can get a job jumping out of the ball pit and scaring away kids who have been there for too long. I mean, look at him. He's wearing that apron over his suit like it's a last-minute Halloween costume. What are you dressed as? Oh, an undercover boss they recognize in the first 30 seconds? Although my favorite part was watching how unengaged he was when the people who actually worked there tried to educate him on how the fryer works. I've worked in restaurants, and if you were training someone who looked like that, while you're explaining the job to them, you call your manager and say, we're totally yeah. The only reason the photo op happened in the first place is because Trump is triggered by the fact Kamala Harris actually worked at McDonald's, and he certainly wouldn't make life better for actual fast food workers, given that he's against raising the minimum wage, and recently bragged at a rally about how he refused to pay his employees overtime. He really said that. It turns out Donald Trump is a bigger dick than Arnold Palmer's penis. <laughs> This has been A Closer Look.